Hello there, TMGNs. This is Lucky7DX, and that was really, really awkward to say. But here we are with the Pokemon Puzzle Challenge Challenge, and I'm going to be using Pikachu to take down Pidgey, except we're not going to take it down. Actually, we're going to just try to keep it alive for as long as possible, because that's the name of the challenge. We have to basically survive as long as possible without killing Pidgey, because Pidgey's a huge douchebag, but that's okay. I'm going to use Pikachu because type advantages, except that this is Pokemon Puzzle Challenge, and type advantages don't exist. So, yep, this is a post commentary on the run. That, uh, my, my best run that I recorded, I guess. So, we'll see how it turns out. Um, so yeah, Pokemon Puzzle Challenge, I love, I love this game. I'm really glad we did a challenge in this. Uh, it's a lot of fun. Uh, someday maybe I should, I, I'm actually almost tempted to play it someday because I, I, this is like one of those games like I really played a lot as a kid. I, not really Tetris Attack or, uh, Pokemon Puzzle League. I think I always remember it was like, League is N64 one, Challenge is the non N64 one. So, gotta keep that in mind. Um, I don't even know what the heck I'm supposed to even be commentating over here. I mean, I'm moving blocks, it's, especially in the beginning. It's extremely, extremely slow in the beginning because, well, the block pace uh, goes really slow. The challenge comes in maybe around like four minutes or so. The thing just like starts skyrocketing. Things go crazy. Uh, really glad the turnout for this though so far. Uh, there's lots of been lots of really good uh, entries so far, and uh, at least a lot of people in the TMG chat. Which if you are watching this and you're not in the TMG chat, you should go to the TMG chat because it's cool. Shameless plug. Um, but, like, I mean, just based on that, like, I mean, this challenge actually seemed like, like a lot of people had fun with it. I'm really glad to see that, uh, kind of worried that, I mean, Pokemon Puzzle Challenge is probably the most obscure of this sort of puzzle game by Nintendo. But, uh, people seem to have no problem enjoying it, and some people are actually like, Oh my god, Puzzle Challenge, I love that game! And I was like, yes, I love that game too! And it was definitely, I mean, just lots of fun all around. Um, I guess I can talk about my strategy here. I mean, obviously... Uh, you want to keep things as low as possible at the moment because, well, that's just, you know, obviously the lower you are, the less chance you have to die. Uh, also, you know, just try to keep, you know, two... Try to, try to, um... I mean, you, you go for a lot of three combinations, obviously, because you don't want to hurt anyone. Um, and you mostly want to just... I, I mostly just try to stack it so I have, like, you know, a lot of, like, blocks stacked, like, two up vertically like that, and that, so I can easily get a third one when the row comes down, and you can keep things really low that way. And then I accidentally get a four one because... There's the stupid games just like, oh, here you go, have a heart, like, in the last possible second just to screw you over. I mean, by now, if you were playing this game normally, which someday maybe I should record playing this game normally and just for shits and giggles, maybe like a short LP on my channel, or maybe on this channel, or something like that. Um, also, if you haven't noticed already, which you probably have, my mouse is just sitting there. And I didn't notice it the entire time because I was so focused on this challenge that I just... I think, didn't I screw up the first challenge as well with the mouse? Like, this is just like my bait, I can't ever, like do a proper recording for my challenge when I do it right. That's just... Gah! Lucky! Why? Why can't you pay attention when you're recording stuff for this? I don't know. Uh, you Pidgey are giving me way too much garbage right now. Get out of my face! And the, Well, okay. Uh, for the exclamation ones, don't worry about that so much, I found, because there, it's pretty much inevitable that you're going to be getting off those exclamation hits anyway. Pidgey can take, like, five or six of them before it dies, and also, it also, um does recover a little bit of health over time, so you can kind of, I mean, you're about, I, I, I did tend to be about a half health by the time I get to the midway point, like a third to a, a half, you know, the midway point, the midway gate! Oh, and I get an accident, like, that was just stupid, that times two right there, that was, that was dumb. I mean, there's definitely places I definitely could have improved on, uh, just in the heat of the moment, you do stupid stuff, especially with so much experience that I've had this game, like, I just spent the entire time, like, oh my god, I'm so used to, to pulling out chain combos that you just get used to, it's just like second nature, you're like, oh my god. There's a time screw right there. I can go for it. And then I'm like, no, 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 wait, wait, wait. Not supposed to be killing the Pidgey. Damn it. And that's just sort of the name of the challenge. But that's why I like doing these kind of challenges because it forces you to play games in ways you wouldn't normally play them, which is good. I think here I'm gonna get. Yeah, I'm just go for the exclamation thing. Like I said, don't worry about that too much. Um, honestly, if you try to keep them around, they'll just cause junk and they'll get in the way or later. And they'll, especially because they'll always end up um, pretty much end the, uh, stacking up on the top there. See, four minutes, I still am pretty good at the bomb. But now it's gonna start picking up pace here. So. Uh, also try to pace it so you're, uh, if you, if you have, like, another combination ready to go, like, pace it till the end, till, uh, because as you can see, the, uh, the, uh, rows stop going up as, you know, blocks would be eliminated, so wait till one set of blocks is fully eliminated before eliminating another set, so you can kind of maximize the amount of time which the blocks aren't rising, because later on, they'll be rising, and any sort of hesitation is going to be fatal, so, like, around now is, like, when, you, okay, you have to keep eliminating blocks, like right now for some reason I'm just taking way too long, I look how much I already built up in that short amount of time, it's gonna get way worse really soon. Uh, so I think, yeah, I'm just gonna do another one, as you can see, I think Pidgey recovered a bit more health, so that's good, so I can, he can take a few more hits before I murder it! Um, that was way too excited. 
And, well, that's just the basic gist of this, I guess, is just, you know, lemonade blocks, slowly, and it's, it's kind of weird looking back and not watching it, because right now I'm like, oh my god, so many patterns that I could have gotten and I didn't. Yeah, right now, I, that was another one that was, was really slow. I'm already getting really close up there, oh my goodness. That is danger, danger zone, danger zone, danger, Will Robinson, danger. Get another two times two on there. Pidgey keeps recovering more health, though. That's really good. I think I got a little fortunate of how fast it recovered health. I'm not sure exactly what causes it to happen. It seems kind of variable. But right now, I'm in decent shape, so... I mean, it's already five minutes in. I'm still pretty low on the bottom. I still have plenty of different combinations. Like I said, stagger those combinations so you uh, basically minimize the amount of time it rises. And some, I do get lucky a few times I actually had combinations happen as the, the blocks are rising. That's always fortunate when that happens. That, that, that definitely comes in handy. I'm not sure how that wasn't a times two there. I really, really, truly do not know why it wasn't. Because that definitely should have been a times two, I think. I Even watching back here. Hello, phone! Why do you interrupt every freaking recording session I ever freaking do? I don't know. My goodness, I need to, like, break that phone. Um, anyway, disregarding that, um, we're just gonna keep basically burning blocks. I mean, it's it's definitely weird playing like this. Um, I, you never really appreciate how fast it rises until, you know... You play the, like you know the game like this, where all of a sudden it's like, oh my goodness, this thing just takes off so fast. It's just it's pretty crazy actually. Um, I forget exactly how I dex. It seems like I have pretty decent health right now, but um, as you can see th th by the video time, it's not gonna last that much longer. Um, I do just and uh, yeah, things are going still. Oh well, there's a time to do there, so that's another hit. Uh, and I mean basically this is the basic just the challenge. I mean there's not really much. The only reason I wouldn't, like, know if I want to do an LP, I mean, obviously if I did an LP of this, I'd have to do it, like, uh, I would have to do it live, because this is just like, okay, what exactly do I talk about? I'm just sort of burning blocks. Also, use the garbage to your advantage, because the more you get rid of the garbage, I mean, it stalls time out when you're getting the garbage. Oh my goodness, twice in one recording session. I don't even know what to say. This. Oh, that's why, because I got a times two stop, and when you get er, a times two exclamation, that's just, like, massive blow to Pidgey's health there. So, Pidgey's almost dead. I'm kind of trying to survive here without killing it, but right now I'm almost dead anyway, and then I accidentally get a 6, and that's going to be it! My time is 7.07, which is freaking awesome, I mean, come on, that's like incident win right there, I don't care if people get like, freaking 9.59 times 100, I got freaking 7.07, .07 and I'm pretty happy with that. So that's going to be my challenge, guys, I'm sorry about the interruptions, I'm a gazillion times, despite this commentary is so freaking scattered, because I don't really know what I'm talking about, but this is Lucky7DX signing out. Thanks for watching, guys. Thanks for participating in this TMG challenge. Stay tuned for the next one. 